Hey y'all, so I'm making a lot of DIY videos um, lately and I decided to make my placemat purse and record it again um, so that you all would see how I made this. So um, I have a placemat that I chose from my local store and it's just a damask pattern on it and it's a cream color. I don't know if you can see it very well. And it was two dollars. Was it two dollars? Let's see. Actually it was one dollar. This was one dollar. And I'm gonna turn this into a purse. So stay tuned if you're interested in learning how to do this. Okay, guys, so what you're going to do is you're going to figure out how you want this placemat to sit as a purse. So I just folded it in half. And I'm going to just crease this part. And now I got these two flaps. So now I don't know what to do. So now I have to figure out how I want that to go. So what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm going to double these flaps up so that they will overlap and give me this look. And I think that would be cute. So that's what I'm going to do for right now. And I'm just going to glue this first part down like this. Because I'm going to use glue. I'm not going to sew it. Even though if you sew it, it'll be a little more sturdy. But I'm just going to use glue because it goes by quicker. And then if I want to make any changes, I can just try to change it later. So just do like that. Follow along with your glue. And you want to move swiftly because the glue gets cold quickly and it won't stick. So once you've done that, then you want to just fold it over and press down as you're folding so that it will stay down. You want to crease really nicely. Get a nice crease there. Because we don't want this part to come up at all. So that is completely down with the glue. I can't even get this up. Okay. So this part we're not going to seal down. Because when we open it we want to be able to get in our clutch. So we're going to seal the sides of this down. So I'm just going to seal my sides down with the glue. And I'm just following along the glue along here. One single line straight across. Once I've done that, I'm just going to secure it. And I'm, when I'm securing it, I'm just matching it up, making sure it's completely even, and then just pressing down on it really good, and making sure everything is tightly pressed for just a few moments. And as you can see, it seals. Can't open it. Can't pull it apart. Do the same thing for the other side. Follow this line, the seam, all the way down with one long bead of glue. And if you are a little insecure about it, you can add more glue. Just don't get it too close to the end because you don't want to get it to where the glue is coming out. And you can tell it's glue. Like how I just did there, you want to wipe that off so people won't be able to tell that there's glue on there. And you're just going to press here again and make sure it's nice and tight, secure. Okay, so pretty much you have the formation of your clutch. There's my clutch. Now what I want to do is I want to make this stay down. See, that's going to do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to crease it a little bit more. And it's still flying up. So what you're going to do now, you want to be able to lift this whole thing up, is I'm going to add a little piece of Velcro here that will help me in my st sticking of it. So I'm just going to take my Velcro. I have some black little Velcro dots. So this is the top and this fluffy part is the bottom. 
So what I'm going to do is I'm going to glue the bottom down and then I'm going to glue the top on the top part. So I want it to continue to just crease this it will stay a little bit better um, I could line it with velcro I don't want to do that I don't want to have that look so it will take maybe a little time to do that but you know just keep pressing it so that it'll stay firm and close so anyway another thing is it's um, actually kind of plain so I'm going to put a little ornament on the other side and now I'm thinking that I may want to um, remove my velcro closing before it completely dries because I just had another great idea it's possible that I could just put two velcro closes on the sides and it'll lift up so let's try that and see if that will work a little bit better This is how the Velcro looks, and you just close it up. And that did give us a better seal. And when we want to just pull right open and just look, but just don't let anybody see inside your purse, okay? So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna ornate the outside, and I found this little button. And I work with buttons a lot. So I'm going to use this, and it has a shank or whatever this is on the side. I'm going to grab my wire cutters. And I just take these wire cutters. You can get these at the Dollar Tree. And I'm just going to grab my little piece here and I'm going to just pull it till either it comes out or it pops off. In this case, it popped off. So I want to make sure I can lay it flat and I'm just going to glue it right there i think that looks fine like that um i don't think down there and i don't want to block my opening so i think i'll put it right there in the middle in the middle so all i'm going to do is get my glue and i'm just going to glue around this whole part here and lots of glue and I'm just going to press this down where I feel the center is. And as I feel like that is dry, which I feel like it is dry, voila, there is our placemat clutch. So thank you all for watching and stay tuned for some pictures. So I decided to take this apart because I didn't like the bulkiness. I like it to be a little bit more flat. Um, that was a different design that I was just happening to try for the first time. So. I took the Velcro off and I took the top and I folded inside the top that went like that. I folded inside and I'm going to glue these, glue this down again. My glue gun is warm enough now. I had, I just, when I was holding it, it just didn't feel very good to me. I didn't like the way it felt. Gluing it down just like before and securing it.
same thing on this side. And this is much better. This is much better like this. I like this better, even though, you know, but you open it up and it's like, it's already there. It's, just, it's already, I, I don't like all that trying to get the stuff. And I don't like the Velcro too much if I don't have to use it. But this is easy because it's, you open it up and the stuff is right there. So that's great. Now let's add this out on this part. And let's just put the glue on here. Let's just press that down, front and back. Save my little Velcros for another time. Okay. And this is still, this is my finished product. All right.